shot in the head and left for dead. The dog is named Maverick, found by a good Samaritan about two weeks ago near the John Hines National Wildlife Refuge. Now, he did survive after surgery, but not without lifelong injuries. Philadelphia police, they need your help to find out who is behind this act of animal cruelty. Our Jennifer Joyce has more, and just a warning, some of his injuries may be difficult to look at. When Maverick first arrived here at Mainline Animal Rescue, doctors say he was in critical condition. Less than two weeks later, he is doing great as the investigation into who caused these injuries continues. Running around like a typical happy puppy. Unless you look closely, you'd never imagine the horror that Mavericks endured. He was in pretty rough shape. Dr. Alicia Royer of Mainline Animal Rescue says on Wednesday, November 20th, Maverick was shot in the head at close range and left for dead. A good Samaritan found him in the area of Crane Street near John Hines Wildlife Refuge. The bullet entered his frontal sinus. Um, it came out kind of below his left eye there and then grazed and split his nose. Um, I mean, if it had been centimeters um, in a different direction, I think we'd be probably without Maverick here. Maverick has now undergone two surgeries. He's blind in the left eye. Animal cruelty cases always hit hard. Each and every time, um, it's, it's shocking and it's sad and you kind of, the whole team is upset and it's, you know, it's hard. His care team calling him Miraculous Maverick, the young pup resilient and ready for his next chapter. He is um, energetic, he's excited, he loves to eat, he loves to meet everybody. Um, he's overcome a lot and he, he doesn't seem to, you know, fault somebody who, who did this to him. While Maverick is focused on finding a happy home, his team wants the person who did this to him held accountable. We, we don't have a lot of information um, and that's really what we need. It'd be nice for Maverick to have some uh, resolution and, and justice. Anyone with any information about this case should contact the organization's cruelty hotline at 866-601-7722 or you can email cruelty at PSPCA.org. Tips can be left anonymously. Reporting from Chester County, I'm Jennifer Joyce, Fox 29 News.